Hi, I'm Andrew Armstrong. Welcome to the back office teardown lab. Just going to show you something. There's not really too much to tear down in these, and these are, are basically laser diodes. You can see I bought a bunch of them. There's a whole, um, at least five here. Just take off this pesky lens hood. Right, so you can see exactly what I'm looking at. So that's the actual model number of these, and these turn out to be a five volt laser diode in a brass enclosure. So the brass actually acts as a heat sink and you can see that it's a small PCB that's been wedged into a notch in the brass and it's actually soldered in place. So the brass acts as a, a huge heat sink for this. So I'm not going to really dismantle this too much because I want to make something with this. But you can see here there's the actual lens in there and it's quite self-contained. You can see it's a pretty small unit. I don't have a tape measure or ruler to hand, but it, I would say it's about this portion here, the front bit's about five mil, so the whole thing must be about 11 mil long in total. As it's five volts, I've actually happened to have a 3.7 volt lithium cell here. Let's just see what voltage this is before we start. So this is actually a four volt cell or you know, running at four volts without load. It shouldn't be too much load from a laser diode, but you never know. So I'm just going to pop this blue wire, which is the ground, into the black hole. Here we go. And the red into the plus uh, four volts, or plus 3.7 officially. And there you have it. Oop. make a very good connection. It, it seems to shine when I'm not trying to point at the camera. And look at that, isn't that neat? It's got some nice effects here. Frickin' laser beams, guys! Lasers! Um, so be careful if you get these. And uh, I'm just trying to work out some projects with this. And keep... Ch keep um, keep abreast of the channel by clicking subscribe because I'm going to be trying to use these lasers in some interesting projects. And I'm going to start with something basic and then maybe work my way up to something more complicated. So if you want to get some of these, go on eBay. You can get them in a two variants. You can get them in a three volt variant or a five volt variant. There, I got the five volt variant because you know, it's a little bit more handy for projects. We tend to use five volts. Um, just be careful of uh, don't, you know, when you're using these that you don't, you know, stare into this and uh, be careful if you've got kids or pets around. Really, you can do a lot of damage with these on your retina. I read in the paper recently about a child losing, I think, 70% of his uh, visual acuity because he was messing around with a laser pointer in his parents' house. So really be careful with that. And uh, as ever, thanks for watching.